This is Saban Howard. He is a great friend of mine. He is a sculptor, world-class sculptor, just got awarded a world global monument that's going to be 65 feet from the White House doing incredible work. Yeah. And, uh, you know, we have been through five years or four years together, yeah. something yeah. like that, and, and have progressed along the way and I've seen this growth explode. So tell them a little bit about well, what was going on. The, I, I, took, I took, I think, maybe a year and a half of your classes. Yeah. And I was dreaming about becoming uh, very visible and like playing forward what, I, what, I, what my passion is, yeah. which is traditional figurative art. Yeah. So here we are, um, five, six years later, and I got the biggest commission in the United States, which is um, a national memorial. It's the equivalent of doing the Lincoln Memorial or the Vietnam Memorial. Now I'm going to be doing the World War I Memorial. Yeah. And so I thought outside the box. And, and, and the biggest thing I learned from you, Harrison, was you're going to hit speed bumps along the way. Yeah. Don't let them slow you down. They're lessons. Right. Just keep going. Follow your vision. The hit obstacle the ball. is the way. That's right. right. Yeah. Hit the ball in the hole. Not <laughs> look at the hole, hit the ball into in that hole. hole. Focus is everything. Yeah. <laughs> and just keep going because you're going to get hit. Just yeah. keep going. Yeah. That's what I learned from you. Yeah, and it's awesome because when you integrate that and you internalize that, you know, the external must reflect that back. Yeah. So the beautiful thing about that is that there are no limits. And, I'll say, you know, be uh, careful what you dream of. Be dream careful for what you're you, going to get it. Yeah, that's right. Be, be, careful. Careful. Yeah. be careful what you ask for so yeah. you guys uh, don't don't get naughty. All right. <laughs> um, Can I also, show you the project? Yeah, let's, let's take Marbeth, a look at the this is, this is the 65-foot bronze wall that I'm in the middle of designing. And it's called the Soldier's Journey, and there's an analogy here that it has something to do with World War One, obviously, but there's something about life in that you begin on the left side, and it's you're born, and then you go through this life, this battle, and you come out the other side at the end of your life, and you hand your knowledge on to the next generation, and so this is there's a lot of allegories in this and a lot of symbolism, and there's a life lesson in this this project. It's it, imagine this. It's a Memorial to the war, a war, yeah, well, the Forgotten War, right? But it was at one point called the War to End All Wars. That's right. But here's, here's I'm gonna let you in on a secret, okay. Harrison. What's the secret? This is not really about war. It's about healing. It's about healing. It is about the healing. hero's journey. Yeah. And sometimes we go through a war period in yeah. order to get to the that's right. the end of the the healing. That's right. Get to the healing. Well, I'm really thrilled you came by the studio today. Oh, it's my pleasure, my yeah. great pleasure. I love you being here. You had a blast. Yeah. Thank you. Awesome.